Good morning. You're here with Legacy Flat Roofing and Sheet Metal. We're here today in London, Ontario, doing a residential roof. You can see behind me about a one story, just over a uh, garage. Um, interesting detail we have a brick facade on one side, and we have an eaves trough on the other, surrounded by a parapet, maybe three to four inches. So we'll go up there, we'll start laying down some uh, protection board, and we'll show you what it looks like. Hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Okay, welcome back. We've come up on the roof, we've uh, fastened down the protection board. You can go take a look. So on this roof we have we have a couple details. We have a parapet detail, we also have a masonry wall detail, and we have a heat trough detail. The masonry wall we are going to bring our uh, membrane up and over and uh, cap that, seal that in nice. Also the parapet, what we've done because of the wall behind here, the substrate is not, it's rough, it's, it's not a smooth surface, so we actually built it out. So that's going to give us a good substrate to bring our membrane up and over and close it in nicely. New metal flashing closes us in nice and these troughs. So we are going to start laying down the base sheet and go from there. Thanks a lot. Okay, welcome back. We completed putting on the sub, new substrate board. We applied the new base sheet to the field. You can also see the, the color difference, the new base sheet membrane flashing. Let's go ahead and take a look. So this field sheet, it comes up four inches, and then we, we brought the base sheet flashing up and over. You see, so it completely envelopes the perimeter. Its whole parapet now is enveloped and, and it's pretty much waterproof even before we put the cap sheet on. Um, there you go. The only cut, we use two different materials in this case because it's a little cooler day. Uh, the base sheet flashing now, which you see, is more pliable, so it's easier to work with. It molds to the uh, contour of the perimeter well, so there you go. We put a new drip flashing at the ease trough and we're, we're getting there. We have a cape, uh, cap sheet and metal flashing. Let's we'll see what that looks like. Thanks. Okay, welcome back. We finished the job. It turned out beautiful. I really love the way this job turned out. I think the client's going to be thrilled. Go ahead and take a look. Between the metal flashing and building the parapet wall and um, just, the, just the tiny details. I really I, I love this job. Um, go ahead and take a look. So here we have a brick facade coming down. We had an important detail here because water constantly sheds down here. We've got to make sure this is tied in nicely. We have an east trough detail at the end that we have to tie in into the east trough. And this is uh, really the key to this job. We had a parapet here that wasn't flush when we started. It actually started back in here and it, and it was rigid and, and so we built it out and, it, and we capped it. So really couldn't turn out better. Um, if you're in the southwestern Ontario area, we'd love to hear from you. Or you can find us online at LegacyRoofs.com. Thank you so much.